Hi guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Alex Hubbard. I'm a senior systems administrator and I bring regular videos to you uh, to help you grow as system admins and IT professionals. If you haven't already done so, please click that like and subscribe button below. And today we're going to talk about updating Windows 10 using PowerShell. Let's get started. All right, let's get into our lab environment here. I just have a Windows 10 test system spun up. Nothing crazy with it. It's literally just Windows 10 installed. No, uh, no, you know, no any extra software or anything like that. Um, so the first thing that we need to do here is we need to come over to our start menu and we need to run PowerShell as administrator. And once we do that, the first thing that we have to do let me make this bigger so you guys can see it. There we go. Stop that. All right. So the first thing we have to do is set the ex execution policy. Um, we'll type in set dash execution policy. And then it will be remote signed. And this will allow us to install the couple of modules that we have to install. So we can click A for accept all. There we go. The next step we have to do is install module. And it will be PS Windows Update and hit enter. This may take a minute or so to install if I recall. Uh, yes, we can hit yes. It's going to install the PowerShell Windows Update package. You can see the bar just went across the top there. And there we go. So now it's installed. Now we've got to import the module. So we'll do import module PS Windows Update. Oops. Helps if I could type correctly. Windows Update. And that's going to import the PowerShell Windows Update module. Now we can issue the get Windows Update command and hit enter. And this is going to force it to go out and look for updates uh, against Microsoft's update server. Once it goes out, it should go. It should come back with a list here of updates, and we can install them. So now we have our list of updates, and this is a base install of an older image. So there's a bunch of stuff. Uh, you know, there's a bunch of stuff to install. So we'll type in install Windows update. And it should just go through the list and install all the updates. It's going to ask you which one, which one you want to install. I'm going to select a yes for yes to all, but it'll prompt you uh, per KB. So yo, we've accepted all of them. And you can see up top here, it's going to go through and download each of these patches and install them uh, for you. So this is a good way to, you know, manually update a system if for some reason you're having trouble with, uh, you know, the start menu and coming over to do, you know, settings and check for updates. I've run into this very rarely, uh, but this is a handy way to, you know, force an update um, if one is stuck. So great way to, you know, just a just another great way to, uh, you know use PowerShell. So hopefully this helps somebody out. And uh, if you did, please give this video uh, a thumbs up, uh, subscribe below and uh, anything you want to see, leave me a comment.